Gonzalez sisters join us. A pretty, pretty outstanding company. All right, so we go first action of the night. Actually, it's just the afternoon. It feels like the night. First action underway now. Whistle has it. Morales is one of the uh, one of the two that we'll see who won a, a U16 title and is looking to double up here in the junior division. First passive call. Morales. Old level change. Snap. See what she got. Short offense. Cabaldo able to work her way back up. Morales getting her close to the edge. So dead, one minute gone by here in the first period. Shot there. Cabaldo, she's close, and she's gonna get the finish. Two offered. She goes right into a lace, too. Yeah, into that lace. Good work to get to the transition, but Morales, nice defense, fighting wrists, and we're gonna come back to our feet. And Tobaldo, she hasn't been challenged yet in this tournament. Uh, all techs or pins leading up to the finals. And so it'll be interesting to see how she responds maybe in a closer match. Nice shot there for Morales. She's going to respond and take down her own. She goes right to a gut range. We'll see if she's able to get the first of her offense here. Tomaldo's going to go well, and they're going to come back to their feet. Tied 2-2. Gets a go behind, but no control yet. She hasn't brought it back down the mat. All the fighting hands. Oh, it's looking like she may want to go big. Nothing, nothing, no nothing, points nothing, yet. There's going to be at least one for the step out. Just one. So 3 2 now. Yeah, good. Good job there by Tobaldo to avoid getting taken down and only give up the one. Yeah, if she had a couple more seconds, she, I think she would have been able to finish there, but I think that's the right call for you know, no points at the end. It'll be an interesting second period to see who's able to get their offense going. Um, from the start, it looked like Tobaldo was going to be able to get to her offense pretty easily with how, f how fast she was able to score. Um, but then Morales responds real quick, and we're at three to two now. Yeah, it's been a real hard-fought battle. Both these women... Excellent, excellent. Ranked number 11 and four in the country. Tobaldo, 11. Paige Morales, number four. Wrist control there from Tobaldo prevented Morales from being able to secure that 
shot and little two on one attempt there from Tobaldo. Verbal warning for that finger fight. Tobaldo has done a nice job controlling the wrist, and I think that's slowing down some of Morales' offense. Yeah, Morales' semifinal match was 16 to 9. Um, kind of went back and forth, and then she was able to, you know, clear the spread there. But um, she's, she has dy dynamic offense for sure. And you see Tobaldo now trying to execute her offense, but that counter from Morales makes it a 5-2 lead, and then a point goes on the board for Tobaldo on the reversal. So it's 5-3 with a minute 48 left on the clock. Yeah, pretty savvy there from Morales to be able to get that crotch left, take it over, and, and get the two um, ex extending her lead. Brianna Gonzalez going to be a senior at Arroyo High School in California. Excuse me, that's I'm reading the wrong I'm reading the wrong name here. Paige Morales is going to be a junior at Central High School, and wow, another exposure off the shot for Morales to Baldo. Oh, let's see. That was called two and one. Yep. Two and two was offered on the mat, but two and one is is how it's going to be scored. So seven to four lead, and Morales just so dangerous with those counters. Yeah, still a minute and ten to go here. So I, I imagine there's going to be a couple more scoring opportunities, and uh, Tabalo's going to need to capitalize uh, without without giving up points in these offensive exchanges. Yeah, she has not been afraid to pull the trigger. Now it's a matter of finishing cleanly. We saw her with her, her opening takedown in the match demonstrate that she is capable of that for sure. It's 45 seconds to go in this match. Just as Tobaldo shoots, got a, an attention for the finger fight. Goes against Morales. Swing single for Tobaldo. She's close to the finish. Morales still a little bit of a whizzer. Tobaldo's collected that second foot. She's trying to finish this takedown. 25 seconds left. Nice job by Morales to square her hips up. She's in a much better position now. And that earns a stalemate. 19 seconds left. We've seen over the course of these last few days in the finals some incredible comebacks, but they're throwing the brick. Throwing the brick. They're going to challenge and hopefully get a takedown. I don't think they're going to get it. Um, and what that's going to mean is that Tobaldo is now going to need at least four points. Probably what she would have needed anyway. You know, it's going to be unlikely to get a one point score and a two, two point score in 18 seconds. So it's going to either have to be a four point move or take down to transition so it, you know they're gonna look at it I don't I don't know that there's any way that they're gonna overturn this did you see anything that would indicate that they would yeah I don't I don't think so um, I don't think it's a bad challenge right it's worth a try because you still will go ahead with the four points um, but if they if they win right even better yeah 100% so they're putting it up on the big screen we can see it in the arena and on your screen you can see Keely Tobaldo taking a look at that screen. She had a nice attack and had, an att she had, she did have Morales on her hip, but Morales had snuck that wizard in. And so I think that's gonna prevent the points from going on the board. And they're looking at it and they're gonna white paddle that action, no points. So you're gonna see an extra point go on the board for Morales. All right, 18 seconds. Nice adjustment from Tobaldo. Trying to run through this. She just does a little bit of time. Five seconds. Nice defense from Morales. And there you have it. Big win on the big stage for Paige Morales. Pretty impressive with her to, to maintain her composure, stay in good position late as Tobaldo was just attacking relentlessly. Yeah, 
Yeah, and, and you give it up for, for both ladies there. Paige Morales, you know, winning her second title in you know, just a, a couple days here. But really impressed with Tobaldo, too. A, a lot of dynamic offense, just a few adjustments, and she she's right there. Absolutely. I mean, you know, when you're thinking about an athlete that you can work with and develop, one that's willing to take those attacks and get in deep, somebody you can work with for sure, like you said.